to a modding tutorial. In this tutorial I'm going to show you how to install all the correct mods which the pro the pro uh, the syndicate project uses. So yeah I have written a document which you can download in the description of this video which will tell you exactly how to install it step by step but I'm just going to go through it with you now. So once you have this install uh, downloaded, you need to open it up, and um, here you will see what exactly is going to do, and what you are going to need to install. So um, first of all, you need to create a new folder. I've created one for the purpose of this tutorial called uh, "How to Modify Your Minecraft Like Syndicates." and I've made a mods folder and I've downloaded all of these mods here which you can download for yourself um, I'd also like to mention that you need this is a big necessary that you need to download um, WinRAR um, WinRAR it's an archiver so you can uh, extract files and go inside files that are actually zipped such as go inside your minecraft.jar which we are going to need to do to install these mods so once you have all these downloaded from clicking on all these links I just like to mention that I don't own any of these mods um, these are just the links from their pages um, so yeah you need to have a fresh minecraft so what we are going to do is we're going to go to our um, dot minecraft Wait, we're going to go to our dot minecraft so to get to your dot minecraft you do this so you click on the windows icon you type percent app data percent oh, percent and then go into your roaming folder this roaming folder will list a lot of weird files which not many people <laughs> understand but you need to go into your dot minecraft I've got a few and as you can see mine's already modded so what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to make it clean so I'm going to delete my options my mod loader mods delete that um, uh, delete that and delete that so once you have it like this you go to lot run minecraft you press options force update and you click login. Once it re-downloads everything, we are ready to install the mods. Okay, so once you have a fresh Minecraft, we are gonna go straight into installing the mods. So the first mods we are gonna want to install is Mod Loader and Mod Loader MP. You can download them by these links here, Mod Loader and Mod Loader MP. So once you have these downloaded, you need to um, open up your dot minecraft I have a shortcut there and um, you need to extract them so once you're you need to extract them um, I recommend using winrar or 7-zip so I do extract all but I've already got them extracted here so mod loader MP so now this is just mod loader so we're gonna go to the bin right click open with and open with WinRAR Archiver oh. so now we delete the meta inf this is just necessary I, no one really or I don't really know what the meta inf is but you need to do it so we dr select all of these drag them and drop them in there same for mod loader mp um, so once we have these installed we just run minecraft just to make sure they are installed properly because sometimes there could be an error and I wouldn't worry so as you can see mine have installed properly now we're going to install all, all of the other mods so now we're in the bin still we select open with WinRAR extract the mods Amazon so what we're gonna have to do here is we're gonna drop drag and drop all of the other mods 
files other than the TF2 because they're a bit difficult to install and we'll drag and drop these eight files I keep on doing this for them all audio mod fishing um, more stackable as you can see it is really simple and it doesn't take much skill shell right so we have all of these other than tf2 dispenser so we'll just close this watch minecraft allow minecraft to ready them and install them we'll also check and see if we've got them installed so let's go to the test world so as you can see i've got the homing bow which is part of the um, what was it? Mm. Teleporter? No, not teleport. I, I forgot. But we've got the fishing. Look, these are the new fishes. Then there's the things. Fishing module. Uh, recipe book. Where's the armor stand? Well, there is the armor stand in here as well. And then there's auto switch. To enable auto switch, you have to press F10, which will, like, D thing your mouse and you can go like that and it'll auto select but I'm in creative so I can't really show that off so let's close this and now we are going to install uh, the TF2 mods so what we do is we go back to the dot minecraft and we with these extracted TF2 files we go inside them and there's the mod mods folder as similar as there is there and a resource as similar as there is there again so we go into the mods mods here and we drag and drop. I suggest you copy and paste them in case something goes wrong. I just realized because it does take them. So then same for the resources. So as you can see there's a mod and a mod here, so you go into the mod, sound, sound, TF2, control C, control V. Right, so we then go back. Oh no, we go here extractor and same for the tf2 sentry resources mod sound tf2 sentry control c control v then same again control c control v so we now have all the sounds installed we need to get the minecraft mods Got the dispenser there. Control C, Control V, and Control C, Control V. So now we have all the mods correctly in the right place. We do launch Minecraft, then login. I'll go white full screen. Single player test world. And as you can see, we now have, if I can find them, we now have all of the TF2 mods installed. So the Sentry, Teleporter, this is what Tom's currently got. This is that Syndicate, by the way, if you don't know him by his first name. In his uh, Syndicate project, he's making Teleporter. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video and found it helpful. Um, I am Syndicate's mod guy, that's what he calls me and have fun playing Minecraft like Syndicate does and have a good